So since I'm the instigator, the peer pressure, the drug seller, no, um, of this channel, I wanted to do Naramon's YouTube survey, uh, which is it's kind of old, kind of, like three months old, but uh, I just think it would be fun to learn this about um, Cassie and Nick, and I don't know if they're going to post this, but yes. First question, please. My first kiss was with my first boyfriend when I was 16 on my couch and it was December time and it was really, I was really nervous because it was my first time and he was experienced because he was a bit of a man whore and I'm not exaggerating that in the least bit and um, I don't know, it was just, it felt special at the time but then a couple months ago I found out the way he got me to kiss him came from a movie that had just come out earlier that year. So, that makes me feel special. <laughs> anyway, moving on. I'm, okay, I'm the worst girl ever. I don't like shopping. I hate it. I hate it, I hate it, I hate it. I don't only go shopping if I need something, like, die or need something. So, uh, this is going to make me sound really bad because most of the things that I have were bought for me, and that's mainly because I'm an only child, and I'm the only girl of six grandchildren. Yeah, all my cousins are boys, <laughs> and so I was always really spoiled, and oh, that makes me sound horrible. Uh, yeah, the most expensive thing I've ever bought is probably this beautiful piece of work. Uh, 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 it was 20, 25 euros, I think. Which doesn't sound like a lot, but it is. Or it was in 2009. I don't know what the conversion is, but it beats the sh boots that I bought the other day. <laughs> this is kind of a long thing because I've had, I've been fortunate enough to have different friends in every school I've been in because, well, I'll explain. <laughs> so in elementary, we all grew up from kindergarten to sixth grade together. And so I was friends with everyone, but I hung out with seven girls and all the boys, like all the boys, all the guys were my friends. And um, the five girls were the really popular girls, and then two of them were like the rebelly kind, and I just kind of like wavered in between, and they were really fun. But then all of these people and all my guys went to one junior high, and me and six other people that I knew but I wasn't really like close with went to another junior high. So in junior high, I was forced to get new friends, and that consisted of one girl. Like I, okay, I'm the kind of person that I'm friends with everyone, but I only hang out with a certain couple people. Um, I hung out with one girl. I hung out with six guys. So I had seven really good friends then, and we always had a blast. And then they all went to one school. Me and one other person went to the same high school, and I love. Pretty much everyone from our junior high went to two other high schools, and me and this other guy who became part of this little threesome here, I <laughs> went to one school. So when I was in high school, so sophomore in high school, I had one girlfriend and three guy friends, and then junior year it went to one and one because these two were pissed off at me, and then senior year. I got one back, so I had two and one, and then in college, um, this guy was still pissed off at me, so we didn't, we're not really friends anymore. This girl, we don't talk very much anymore, so we're just going to put her aside. <laughs> and then this one, I'm going to flip you off for a second, this one, this, this guy right here, this one, went on a mission, and he's still on a mission. This guy ended up marrying an old friend of mine that I considered a sister. And it's also the guy that I had my first kiss with. So this is accurate. <laughs> now those all those friends are gone. And I have one guy friend, which is on this channel. One girlfriend, which is on this channel. And then one other friend that I knew in high school. One other girlfriend that I knew in high school. And we hang out a lot. And I'm using my thumb because there's the height difference. <laughs> I'm so rude. Moving on. Here's the 
all the jobs that I've ever wanted to be. I wanted to be singer, dancer, choreographer, dance teacher, which I guess goes together, and teacher, and an architect. Uh, right now, I'm on the track to being a teacher. Why I chose teacher over architect, I don't really know, especially because the salary is kind of like this. <laughs> I used to do a lot of stuff. One thing that has always stayed with me is singing, dancing, and teaching. And I still like architecture. Like, I love looking at houses and being like, ooh, I want to put this in my house. I want to build my own house. I want to draw a sketch of how I want my house to look like and, you know, all that stuff. It really fascinates me, but I don't think I could ever be a real architect, and that's kind of depressing. But, so I'm on my track to being a teacher, and that's always been a really good job of mine that I've wanted to be. So, basically my first job, let's get back to the question, <laughs> basically the first job I've ever wanted was singer and teacher. Those have always kind of been even with each other. Question number four, please. Or wait. Question number five, please. I haven't really thought of what I want my kids' names to be, but I do like a lot of names. Um, I have... I don't even know, one girl name and like three guy names that I really like, but I'm not like, these have to be my children's names kind of thing, because I think that your husband should decide, and I'm really excited to have Cassie, you know, say these <laughs> things, because her daughter is going to dress as a slutty fairy for Halloween, and it's hilarious. <laughs> is obviously Cassie and Nick. Thanks for watching guys. I know we've been on hiatus for a while, but it's holiday now, so maybe we'll get more. Maybe? Possibly? Maybe? Hopefully? Yeah? Mm? Uh, uh.